Hey everyone, welcome to Metal Guns and Outdoors. Yeah, I'm in case you're still out here shooting, and we plan to be out here for a while. <laughs> Sun's starting to go down a little bit, it's cooling off. Feels great out here. And when you have fun things to shoot, why stop? Mm -hmm. Next up, we got a Beretta U22 Neos. And what's cool, this one's out of Gallatin, Tennessee. Of course, you know us Tennessee guys. Love to see that local manufacturing. Notice I'm wearing a Beretta shirt, supporting our guys. Ain't that thing just wicked? This, uh, of course, this was sent by Gun Prime uh, for Hootie Hoo to shoot, so we want to throw a thank you out to them. Thank y'all, guys. I've been dying to shoot this. Mm -hmm. How many kids? Looks wicked. Looks like an actual marksman pistol. Now, if George Jetson owned a pistol, this would be <laughs> it. Yes. This thing is, oh yeah, that's the magnets. Yeah, it's odd. Hmm. We're going to try some uh, Aguila 40 grain, the super extra high velocity in this. Let's see how it runs it. There we go, we got 10 of them in there. Hey, my, it goes in there like butter, man. Super hard to chamber. <laughs> Don't even pick up one. Now the mag's in. All right. He's on safe. All right, Casey. We'll do a we'll do five and five, so we can both get some fun out of it. Uh, I'm gonna put uh, two on paper. I'll go for the headshots this time, and you can have the uh, bullseye. And then I'm gonna pop some steel. Before it's over with, we're gonna try to hit some chops. Let's see how sharp we are today. All right, guys. All right, I got the George Jetson gun. Let's see what she'll do on some headshots. That handle is really weird. One hand feels good. Two hands is just weird. He lives. It's hard to see that front sight. Safety's on, Casey. That white, that back sight's got the white on it. It's really good. That front one being, to me, it just looks all black. Yeah. And with the sun going down, it's a little hard to see, but, uh, I think you'll do good with it. Yeah, no place for your other hand. <laughs> no, not at all. No teacup it if you have to. There you go. Safety. I don't even see where you hit. Oh, don't either. I'll try you some steel. Right. We're making ourselves look bad. Yeah. Because Miss Hootie Hoo can out shoot us with that gun. Alright, let's straighten this up. I like the gun. Don't like the sights. Yeah, the sights are, wouldn't be bad if you could just take some nail polish and put it across the front, though. So you can actually see it a little bit easier. Definitely, yeah. Yeah, a little on that front sight would probably do the trick. All right, let's talk to Kenny a little bit. Malfunction.
it, next round was sitting in there sideways. A oh, white plate. Yeah, I just have to figure out where the sights were. Yeah. It's good. Safety's on. Those 22s for me. I like that little pistol. All right, I'm gonna take the one over here on the right. Got a pinkish looking shot. If I can hit it. Come on, George, get some gun. I got my chalk. Took me about four tries, but I got it. Safety's on. I had to aim a little low in order to hit it. The way I was looking at that sight. That's alright, you can't do them all. Lord knows I've missed my share of them, that's for sure. Well, Cole, what do you think about that? I like it. But like I said, if you were to get that front side painting, I think I could do a lot better with it. Yeah, this uh, it's a great little shooter. She's clear. Does feel a little funny in the hand. I mean, look at that angle. <laughs> You know, but your hand does fit. Hopefully you ain't got a fat hand. Mine almost doesn't fit up in there. It's a little chubby. But for the most part, it's a good fit. It's comfortable. Trigger's great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's just that sight. That front sight. That little white dot right there. It would be awesome. But besides that, the Brada Neos U22. I would have one. Most definitely. Well, guys, thanks for watching that video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you would, please leave us some comments, questions, and suggestions. Uh, if you're able, hit us up on Patreon. And please, hit that like and subscribe button. Thank y'all, and I hope y'all have a fantastic day.